Welcome to the September 2023 update of the Stellantis LG Energy Battery Gigafactory. My name is Bob Jones and I will be your host for this video. Please like, share and subscribe to follow these updates. Stellantis LG Battery Gigafactory have named the project Nexstar Energy EV Battery Plant. This mega project is located on the southwest corner of Banwell Road and EC Row Expressway in Windsor, Ontario. As of the latest search results, the Next Star Energy EV battery plant in Windsor, Ontario is making progress towards its operational goal to begin production in January 2025. Nexstar is expected to have an annual production capacity in excess of 45 gigawatt hours and will create an estimated 2,500 new jobs in Windsor. When full production is reached at the end of 2025, the plant is expected to employ about 2,200 workers. Stellantis has announced its production plans for the Windsor Assembly Plant in Ontario, Canada. The company will invest 3.6 billion Canadian, that's 2.8 billion US dollars, to convert the Windsor and Brampton Assembly Plants. As well as extend its operations in the region. The Windsor assembly plant will be transformed to support battery electric vehicle capacity for multiple models. It was reported different models to be built at the assembly plant in Windsor will be unveiled in the coming months. The vehicles produced on the new large platform will be built at the Windsor assembly plant. It can support battery packs of up to 118 kilowatts to achieve a driving range of up to 800 kilometers, that's 500 miles. An important foundation for electrification of the assembly plant is the $5 billion investment in the Nexstar Energy Battery Cell Gigafactory. There is skepticism these large investments in electrical vehicles are going to pay back in the five-year time frame that our government has touted. Some professionals believe it will take four times longer than promised by the Liberal government if it is as successful as they hope. For the Windsor assembly plant, it is a big change from combustion engines to battery and there is no easy turnaround if this new technology fails or made obsolete with a revolutionary new breakthrough. The worst case scenario I could imagine is a lot of southwestern auto workers having to look for another job. Even if all goes well, let's hope the cost of electric vehicles becomes much more affordable and our energy grid can support it. Is there another agenda behind the heavy push for an EV market? Maybe. Have you heard about Stellantis' company called Free to Move? Free to Move is a mobility hub that offers a range of services to meet the various travel needs of its customers. Stellantis acquired a company called ShareNow, a car sharing service through their Free to Move company. One of its key services is car sharing, which allows customers to rent cars for short periods of time ranging from one minute to several days or months. Free to Move aims to provide flexible and convenient transportation options for both individuals and businesses. Here are some key points about Stellantis' Free to Move car sharing service. Free to Move plans to expand its car sharing, rental and subscription services globally. The company aims to add 
200 new mobility markets by 2030. Free to move acquisition of ShareNow, a market leader in free floating car sharing in Europe, has allowed free to move to rapidly grow and become a worldwide mobility leader with an established presence of more than 450,000 rental cars currently available throughout the continent. Free to move offers not only car sharing, but also short, medium and long term rentals. Additionally, customers can reserve a VTC, that's a chauffeur driven transport car and parking spaces through the free to move platform. Overall, Stellantis' free-to-move car sharing service aims to provide flexible and convenient transportation options for its customers, allowing them to access vehicles for short periods of time without the need for personal car ownership. So maybe the cost of the cars will become a mute point, because you won't need to own a car, but will you be happy? It's an interesting direction Stellantis is going. Let me know what you think in the comments. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. It will be greatly appreciated. This is Bob Jones, and I'll see you in the next video.